Hey everybody, Neil Thompson, founder of Teach the Geek here. I work with technical professionals so they can present more effectively, especially in front of non-technical audiences. And you can learn more about that at teachthegeek.com. Again, that is teachthegeek.com. And as always, remember to like and subscribe to this YouTube channel as every bit helps. Have you ever given any thought in the way in which you communicate with others? I certainly didn't until fairly recently when I found out about personality styles and more specifically DISC. And DISC is an acronym. The D stands for dominant. I stands for interactive. The S stands for supportive. And the C stands for conscientiousness. And each of those letters indicates a different way that people like to, or a, a, a different way that people's personality styles are. So for instance, if you're communicating with a D, a dominant, they prefer more direct and to the point communication. With an I, it's influencing, or pardon me, interactive, they prefer more social and high active, high activity, high energy type of environments. With supportive, the S, they prefer more thoughtful and sincere communication. And with the C, conscientiousness, they're all about the details. So you gotta give them you know, step by step what they what they need to do. And when you think about it, if you do know these these types of personalities, then maybe you tailor your presentations to fit them more. Uh, how do you even find that kind of thing out? Well, there's all kinds of assessments. That, that provide that, but barring you actually giving these people assessments, the people in your audience, which probably is not going to be the case, at least in some instances, you'll be able to observe people. So just observe the type, observe them, and then see what type of, of communications they respond best to. For instance, if you're in a, in a, if you're giving a presentation and you're getting questions from somebody that are very detailed, then maybe they're more of a C type of personality. And so when you give presentations to that type of person, make sure that it's not just fluffy, make sure there's a whole lot of details in it. And for the person that's more of a D, for instance, if you're getting a lot of direct and pointed questions, maybe that's the type of communicator they are, or the type of person that personality type they have, they're more of a D, more of a dominant. And so maybe you you tailor your presentations to to suit that person. Or you may very well have a bunch of people in your audience that are all of them, D, I, S, N, C. So maybe you've thrown a little bit of everything to satisfy everybody. Don't don't go well, don't go too crazy about it though. But that's just something to keep in mind. We we certainly have our own personality styles, and we assume that other people will be amenable to those to our personality styles. But that's not always the case. So if you want to get the most out of the presentations that you give, well, keep these personality styles in mind when when giving your presentations. D, dominant, I, interactive, S, supportive, C, conscientious. Hopefully it's been helpful. Again, my name is Neil Thompson. I'm the founder of Teach the Geek. I work with technical professionals so they can present more effectively, especially for non-technical audiences. And you can learn more about that at teachthegeek.com. Again, that's teachthegeek.com. And as always, remember to like and subscribe to this YouTube channel as every bit helps. Thanks. Have a great day.